Yeah, office work 10. 30 on you. 24 on you. My office work is terrible. But our work will is getting like way up there. Video game boom. Ooh. Hopefully people use my engine for that. Cooking sim would be a really cool thing to have released right now, but I'm kind of busy doing other things. <laughs> Mr. Do Two. Go. Your speed and office work are getting really high up there. 45, 31 on you, 21, 36 on me, 20, yeah. Definitely worth doing. Although we're getting plus ones and zeros. Ew. Gross. I think they're sort of hitting their limit, maybe. Ugh. Alright, so that's that. Uh. I guess we'll grab this desk. Throw it in there. I do... Yeah, there we go. That's good and cramped. Although, I think I would need... We'll leave marketing. We'll grab a research desk. There. And you guys can help out up here now. Eventually, got it. <clears> that <throat> thing is a bit strange sometimes. So that's that. That's done. So we still have room for a marketer. We have enough desks for everybody here in development. So now we could... Uh, we'd have to bank it for more money because... Uh, shit gets expensive. Let's maybe go for... Yeah, actually, let's go for a new research topic. Ugh. God. Did I not grab enough people? Oh. There we go. He was pathing outside, so I thought I'd drop him back in. Go for, because I quite like the RPG stuff that we're doing. Uh, it would be nice to get more genres set up. However, if we stick with RPG, let's change up the topic a little bit. Because I feel like doing the exact same thing over and over and over again is not going to be a good thing. I see Apocalypse. Hmm. We've got like everything, man. I won't be able to make the cooking in time. The dating RPG. Hmm, yes. Ah, yes. I mean, dragons, druids, dwarves. I mean, you sort of... You can really... There's elves, eroticism. Everyday life. Oh, shit. The everyday life simulating uh, simulation game. Fantasy? Can't really go wrong with a fantasy RPG, can ya? We got a couple people here just sitting, not doing anything, but the research won't be that long, so... There we go, we have $954 to our name. Excellent. No. Ah, the desk! There. And then this desk. Uh. I'll throw it in marketing for now. There, so that's full. So. Simulation cooking. No. Just you. There you go. Now. 
I'd like to wait for this to do something. Throw you in marketing. Okay, no, fine. I got it. I got it. We'll just do contract work until that time's out, and we'll see what's popular uh, in 12 weeks, and we'll see if we can A, get out of debt with contracts, B, see if we can uh, hit whatever's trending. Ideally, it's something that's like, we already have the genre for it, we just need a topic. If it's just a topic, cool, I can really easily do that. We're in debt, but that should be okay. Get this shit finished. Got it. Okay. Contract work. Four weeks left, 2,000 points. Ugh. Let's sort it like this. Eight weeks left, 130,000. Ooh. That's some, let's compress some data. That sounds fun, right? I might even get rid of the, uh, might get rid of this whole thing and just turn it into the graphics and audio departments as well. Because I'm not sure, I'm not sure this is really paying off. I mean, people spend so much time in there throughout the day. That's like, is the benefit really that worth it? Four weeks on that. Let's try it. Four weeks, it's a big salary thing. Try it. Oh, you're playing the game. Okay, the sound effect played early. I was like, what blew up? Of course, we're on a deadline. Everybody just arcade it. That's fine. Everybody just hang out in there all day, every day. That's that's cool. We're not on a on a deadline or anything like that. Hmm. Zero weeks left. Yeah, we we didn't do it in time. Burner. Yeah. All right. Contract work. Oh, we're there. RPGs unpopular. Well, platformers. I have platformer, right? No, we don't. We don't have platformer either. <sighs> All right. I keep picking up people instead of furniture. Let's bash out some research real quick. We need platformers. Let's see about doing some really nice lengthy contracts. 11 weeks. I mean, we should be able to do that, right? It's music. 46, I'm on it. 25. 25, path better. 25, 23, okay. We got kind of our best people working on it, so that's... What are you actually doing? There we go. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, like the majority of the week is spent them just hanging out in here. I'm not mm, not seeing the benefit. I mean, we we're doing just fine without it. And here we are with it and people just spend time in there. They're not their work will is kind of high, but I don't know. Overall, I'm not really seeing much of a thing. And then Ice Age as the topic. Oh god. Ice, ice, ice. There we go. There. 
So desk. 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 You guys are all in here. Help us out with the contract. Excellent. So, Ice Age Skeletons. Okay, we don't have that much credit. Excellent. Uh, although people like totally aren't using our engine and it's making me a little upset. The only difference being I don't have a head office anymore. Maybe I need a head office? There. Head office, get. So now I can do all that stuff. Did I need that so that I could have people buy my shit? Yeah, that's not really a room that they can work in. I don't know. It just kind of is what it is. So let's develop a game then. Oh, right. We can't, uh, we can't do... Okay, it'll have to be B+, plus. that's fine. For all ages, I suppose. The topic is... Ice Age. The genre is... Platformer, we know nothing about these. And it'll be with Snowball 3.2.02. Mall Fighter. Nah, good resident. Eh, nah, Planet of Tanks. Nah, it's a platformer in the Ice Age. Resident, good. Quar. Sure, we'll go with Quar. So, platformer. Quick reactions, excessive violence is abhorred in this genre. So, like, no violence at all, whatsoever. And Ice Age Hover River tells me nothing, yeah. Okay, so... Quick reactions. So platformer and squill, quick reactions and hand-eye coordination. They seem to go well together. Platformer and skill? Nah, let's just stick with platformer, keep it simple. That'll be fine. And obviously PC, only 35% market share. What else do we get? By dev kit. 13.5 on the Nintendo MES. 23 grand for it though, uh That's an easy one. The the Apple Muck only 5,000, 11 percent market share. That'll be okay. I think we'll get our money back for it. And all these are good for up to B plus, so we're okay there. So we'll do that. It's on the PC and Apple Muck. And I could do a third platform, but bleh. Copy protection, buy copy protection. Do I really need it though? Like, at all? Jesus, that's expensive. But really effective. I don't really think I need it. At all. I've never, I don't think I've had an issue with it. So I have no idea on, like, at all what the genre needs. It's a platformer, so I'd imagine something like that. I have no idea. Shot in the dark. We're really just going for... Uh, the trend because RPG is unpopular and RPG is kind of what we do, so we sort of have to lunge towards something else. Ugh. Well, it's expensive either way, so there. And bank it. Borrow 250 grand, 439,000. We need to borrow even more. God. 
Okay. Um, branching AI, parallax scrolling. We're, we're stuffing it. It looks like it'll still let me continue though. Even though we're stuffing. Okay. Well, let's get rid of... It just, it doesn't scroll. I think it would have to scroll. Oh, I don't know. We don't necessarily need a joystick. It's not an arcade game. So there. Because of the, the arcade game thing said that joystick driver would be like, you need a joystick for it. So. We'll try that. Oh, God. And then... Having somebody marketing would be cool. Should I just hire somebody for marketing? I might. I, ju I, I just might. You guys are all kind of bad not if you do RPGs, so you're all really not that great in the long run. Ugh. Sure, I guess. You're, you're on marketing. Create marketing campaign for the game, Quar. Holy shit. Maximum hype. Posters? How long will that take for you? Pretty good amount of time, but you'll, uh, you'll beat release, so that'll be fine. Well, hopefully it works out for us, because uh, if it doesn't, sure, because we've spent a lot of, uh, a lot of money on it already. We're up to 700,000 in credit. And there we go. Finally, somebody licensed the engine to, oh my god. I was just thinking about that, like, nobody's licensed their engine in a really long time. I think next time I might go back down to about 18-20% to because we were getting a lot of licenses then. So, the posters are done for Quar. Uh, you beat us by a pretty good amount. So you could go for... Local magazines too. Generate some more hype for it. QA room. Would that be like... Okay, hold on. That's pretty cheap. Okay, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll move this door. Down to there. Quality assurance. Man. Just like auto bank. Assurance. Uh, uh. And then quality assurance. Just desks. Looks to be. So then I could have um remove bugs, improved gameplay. 
Okay, so this might be after I complete the game, but before I release it, I do this, because I think that's what it was for the graphics and audio rooms too. And then I can create game report. Just detailed feedback, I'd imagine. And then remove bugs. Cool, so you finish doing that, then I'll have you hop over here and you can work on bugs. Yeah, only seven hype. Like marketing, you have to like really pound out marketing. So head into here, remove bugs of Quar, because 31 bugs is quite a lot. And arrow pointing because you're supporting that project. Cool, and just over time you're getting rid of bugs. Nice. We got 35 weeks left on that, so let's get Rogue on. Helping out with removing bugs too. Get that number down, because that's that's a lot of bugs. We've never had that many before. And somebody's got a little plus sign over here. Are we okay? Yeah, yeah I guess so. I saw it back there. It's like a first aid symbol. Because I saw this. Licenses. That's like, that's what's been keeping me afloat this entire game. If it wasn't for the engines and all that, we'd be so bankrupt. There's Ermagerd. Need to head back into the bank, borrow more money. Our overhead's getting kind of high. In 26-ish weeks? Yeah, 26 weeks left on Ice Age. So we got time. Might even be able to head back into here and see about doing... Oh, I'll let you finish doing that. See about doing improving gameplay or whatever it was. The really sound and uh, technology is lacking significantly. Oh no, we're working on 8-bit uh, music, eh, music now. So that'll be that. Cutscenes are out. 318,000 for Dangerous Morning, which was the... Game of the year, I think, actually. Hell yeah. Don't publish it now. Keep working on it, because bugs. Get another desk in here. And get... Probably me. In there. Finish up the bugs. I should buy more trash cans? Okay. Like, I didn't... I don't know. I didn't know this stuff was a thing. <laughs> so there, trash can, trash can. Trash can, cool. Get rid of those bugs. And then once you do that, we still got some, uh, some good time. In fact... While we're doing nothing, we got uh, some marking that we can do. Ugh, ugh, ugh. It's this giant ass tooltip that's in the way. Like, I can't, uh, I can't see behind it. There. And then whoever's in here still. There. Create marketing campaign for Quar. Radio. Talk about it on the radio. Shit. Bugs are fixed. Improved gameplay. Of course, that's all. That's all locked. I see. Okay. Create game report. Uh, wait a minute. I think that's what all that was. 
Okay, quick. Move the desks. <laughs> I'm not going to be doing this for long. I will be buying um, extra desks so I don't have to keep doing that mess. And somebody, I don't think. Yeah, there we go. Three people in there now. Research others. Uh, game balance. Work on those. We'll see if we can improve it with that. Ooh, RTS. Mm. Okay, quick, everybody. Inequality assurance. Oh, everybody picks up their desks and runs it over. Ah, itty. Nice. Improve gameplay. Game balance. Gotcha. Let's do that real quick. There we go. Uh, marketing campaign real quick, just like some flyers or some shit. Nice. I would like to release it uh, while, wow, Jesus, while it's still trending. Going to throw something away way over there. It's just, it's a bunch of stuff that just distracts people though, like, I don't, ooh. And we'll throw a card here. Jesus, we're hyping the shit out of this. Excellent. 4,000 more fans. And 23 hype. Like, we're doing, we're like going full Duke Nukem here. We're just continuously just hyping this game. Not releasing it, just hyping it. A lot. And I think... Would I be able to improve gameplay again? No, already done. I got it. Okay. So now we release the game. It's bug free. It's been hyped. 23 hype. We improved some of the gameplay. Release game. Publish it. It's trending. It's got 10 weeks left on it. It's a platformer. So find somebody who's interested in platforming. Nanko and they like us. Okay, and Taytee, but we don't know who they are. So they got market strength. Our relationship's good with them. Platformer, it matches. Bang. And we're unique. Graphics look really good. There isn't much to complain about. The sound is below average. Hopefully they'll do better next time. Controls are just a little too complicated, but the game is playable. Although the game has gameplay weaknesses, one can live with it. The game is average. Genre fans can buy it safely. Graphic top can trend. Genre and trend. Very nice. I'd say that's a success. I'd say that's a great success. That's a pretty good rating for us, especially since we know nothing about platformers. Like, at all. So can I still market it? I can. I see. 